So today's a little bit shorter. I want you guys to use this as kind of an active recovery day. Um, if you want to do something a little more intense, maybe do a day that you missed. If you haven't missed any days, you definitely need an active recovery day. We also are gonna have a stretch class at five o'clock with Charlotte. So maybe that's something that you wanna do instead. This will still be at six. Charlotte's class will be at five. If you guys only have a kettlebell, I'll show you how you can do plank rows with a kettlebell. So I'm gonna use a bench. You could use a cooler or something. So you're gonna find a spot for your feet that works well to make your body in that plank position. And then you're gonna do your rows this way. So 10 each arm. And then you'll switch. Then we have 20 toe touches. So you're gonna lay on your back, feet in the air, up, up, for 20. And then we have 10 per side, single leg RDO. We should be getting pretty good at these. If you wanna hold your kettlebell, you can. You don't have to. Just, I want to focus on this leg staying straight. So, Without the kettlebell, it'll look like this. With the kettlebell, helps balance you a little bit. Legs stay straight. And you're gonna do 10. Then switch legs, also 10. One thing that kind of happens is your knee is going to want to cave in. Focus on pushing it out. So as you hinge forward, if your knee goes like that, think, okay, push it out. Maybe I don't come down so far. See, I lost balance. So here, stay on the outside of your foot. As you come down, really push the knee outward, then come back. Now we've got something to just kind of get your heart rate up. One minute of high knees into one minute of butt kicks into one minute of jumping jacks into one minute of plate on offs. I don't have a plate. So you'll stand in place, hands here. You're going to bring your knees up as high as you can. I would suggest staying on the balls of your feet. Nice lightweight taps. Back and forth. So you're going to do that for a minute. Hands on your back. You're gonna bring your heel to your hand, back and forth. So actually, make contact with your hand. From there, one minute of jumping jacks. Out, in, out, in, out, in. Like that. And then our last piece, we'll just assume that I'm jumping onto a plate, which you can't really see my feet, but off on, off on, forward, back, however you want, just nice lateral taps.